Hey Parker, so it's Tuesday and I wanted to talk about something in your video yesterday. So I really, really agree that like loneliness is horrible and it seems that like the more we become adults the more we kind of really have to get accustomed and used to it. It's also really kind of a lost art to be alone and I know that that sounds so cliche and it's so annoying and I can't stand when like adults are like, you know, all these youths nowadays, they're attached to their cell phones 24-7. It can hold a conversation. But there it really is sort of a forgetting about how being alone is okay. Parker, if you're anything like me and the loneliness does get to be too much, I highly, highly, highly recommend journaling because it can really be a good way to get it all out once you get over the initial like awkwardness of weirdness and it's nice to just you know, sometimes even just like completely awkwardly write about your whole day in this journal. For example, this is my current notebook. I got it from my lovely college, Bowie State. I actually have a long series of journals that people have gift gifted me that I plan on using at some point. Because another one, I think this one actually has a few, yeah, this one has a few random things. And it looks like it's from high school. Oof. This one is more of a vision thing than a journal. Like I have like random junk in here, like papers and stuff. Like, oh my gosh, this is a high school. This was from high school. We're gonna go down Menory Men Lane. Ooh. So this was a quarter through report card in my senior year. And I had three Ds, three Ds. Three C's and two A's. Senioritis was a real thing, Parker. I also have a thing regarding my graduation practice in here. I didn't know I had this still. And it's like telling us what we need to wear to graduation. Oh, and we had to wear white to the girls and I just don't like white. I also have an outline of a story, focus for, okay, yeah. And I never got around to writing it. And I don't know if I ever will, but it was fun to like note about it and kind of world build. It was about time travel, but then I decided that time travel was kind of beyond my capabilities as a writer. Another journal, and this one's empty, I'm sure. No, this one has one, two entries. Oof. Oh, I think this one for a while was the longest running journal. Yep. Oh, funnily enough, the first entry is about a video called How to Be Alone, and that's actually a really, like, kind of uplifting video, and I I'm gonna link it in the description and that kind of like helped me be okay with being alone and kind of see like it in a romanticized light which really helped. Their journal, I think this one was a Christmas gift. I have one friend who likes to give me all these writing things. I love her. Yeah, so we have a whole stack of journals and I'm gonna start filling them up again. I have a couple that are completely filled that are like hidden away because I don't want anyone to read them because they're really personal thoughts if that makes any sense. This one has math and a sticker from the place where I get all my body jewelry. So I'm gonna get journaling again, and uh, maybe you should too. It's a good way to like de-stress and reflect. And I know it sounds really corny because I hate it, because it's really awkward to get used to, but it helps. I'm also turning over a new leaf. I have a day planner. I write down homework and things in it. Focus, focus, color balance. There we go. And it, it really actually does help. I think I'm gonna journal on the days when I don't have a lot. And I'm gonna like, cause like I have things in here all the way to semester's end, I think to like finals week. So that's what's going on with me. This kind of went on a thing. But like seriously, Parker, this video channel is also a pretty good place to vent and just talk and get stuff straight because I know I've used it for that before. And I really do feel comfortable with you as well. I feel com comfortable expressing myself and considering I only get like maybe 10 views a video sometimes or even two views a video, I feel pretty comfortable talking just to myself on here because it's not like an, an extremely public place and it's not like everyone I know ever watches these. It's not like I go on Facebook and make a passive aggressive post. I'm kind of swamped with homework at the moment too, but I it really does help to plan my days. But I'll see you tomorrow, Parker. I really hope you're feeling better. I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> DFTBA, stay super.